Hey guys, what's up YouTube family? Welcome to Around the Clock with Kanye. I'm Kanye. Ian is my name. And Kanye, remember to hit that subscribe button, like, share, and remember to keep the comments respectful. Don't forget to turn on the post notification bell so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. So, you're going to forgive me because I didn't do an intro for this video. We left uh, Malindi very early. Poor lighting and we were in a rush, right? So at the moment we are at a stopover in Makindu, the same place we had breakfast when we were going to Malindi and we want to have lunch, right? Yes. But it's been a good drive. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Right? We should be doing such long drives. So let's go have have what? Let's go and have is it lunch or breakfast? I'm having lunch, I'm not taking breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's lunch or breakfast. Yep, let's yeah, do this. Let's enjoy. also need some buffing as well yes and yeah we can't sleep with a dirty car gosh it's, it's so embarrassing extreme. it has bad poop all over yeah bad poop and i mean the dust from mombasa we didn't go to a car wash in mombasa imagine we yes. were not in mombasa malindi i mean why do i call coast mombasa <laughs> It's an Arabian. It's Everyone an Arabian does, disease. right? Yes. <laughs> okay, so we are headed to Tirivas and we'll see you there. Mm -hmm. Let know what's up, what's happening. Mm. Mm, that's all. Uh, we came to do our uh, yeah, basically, we came for the for our car wash. Yes, our car is extremely <laughs> dirty, extremely insist on that dirty. extremely bad. Yes, so we came for a quick shine. And as we wait, uh, we are here to a new restaurant called Alda. Yep. Yep, to experience their menu and yeah, to test it out. I so, know, so. we've been told to go back after around three hours. Oh, an hour and a half. It's not three hours. Uh -huh. Why do I feel like it's a long time? <laughs> yeah. But it's an hour I think it will be the. Okay. It's a good extreme, extreme car wash, extreme clean. I really can't. I, I don't, I don't it's extremely clean, I guess. Yeah. So we have some food. Whatever you get, can you do us more now? So you got me falling for your ass on it. Whatever you get, can you take some more now? Hey baby. 
Hey. We just had a very good meal mm -hmm. at a nice restaurant. The first time yes. we tried that restaurant. Yes. I'd highly recommend. And another place that I'd highly recommend, Extreme Clean Car Wash. Our car has never been this clean, honestly. It's glowing. It's glossy. Like it's shining as I well. I know, it looks so nice. Yes. Good service and I'd highly recommend. I'm a link up and I told you. Every time I go to a place and find good service and, you know, legit stuff. Yeah. I'm a link you up and this is the place. It's Definitely. Car wash, right? Yes. Let's just go home. We need to rest. Hey, we had a very long drive. Yes, and a very long. Hey, very long. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm uh -huh. done. Yeah, I'm okay. done. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hi, guys. Hi. Hello. So it's a beautiful Sunday. We're just from a very good drive around the Muru area, and that place is so beautiful. Yeah, I love the greenery of yeah. that place. We took a lot of photos. We were with some friends. She had some ideas. And yeah, a productive drive actually. Mm. And you'll see those photos, so make sure you follow us on Instagram at Triti Kanye and Iansky. Yeah, just follow us there. And right now we are on our way to Unicity Mall. There's this place I've been seeing online, China Square. I want to, to go see what they offer. Yep. Yeah, because um, I have a project, an upcoming project. So stay tuned to this channel because you'll know what the project is going to be about. So let's do this. Let's go. Hey. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Please, I'm hungry, honey. Is there anything to eat at China too? No, not really. We'll find uh -huh. maybe a good China town. Hey, we already shall be like a China, but in this hour. It's China Square. It's not in China town. Nah. Nah. You're bad. Hi guys, welcome to hey. today's vlog. Mm -hmm. Hello, where are we? After a very long drive, a very fun drive, and so many what? We are. We at... got lost so many times. Yeah, map it, Poteza. Yeah, is it map Zako? We've been <laughs> roaming around since afternoon, and it's around six p.m. Yes. We are at the ostrich farm. Is it Kitengela or Rongai? I don't know. It's Kitengela. It's Kitengela. It's Kitengela. Yes. Yes. And guess what we want to do? We want to try uh, to try what? Eggs. Ostrich eggs. Ostrich eggs. Ostrich eggs. Ostrich eggs. They're so expensive. Yes, I hope they will be worth it. One goes for around three thousand five hundred bob. Mm -hmm. Averagely. So that's yeah, from average. a reseller. So probably it's worth more because. Yeah, yeah, we checked resort. online, by the way. So yeah, we're in a so resort. Just checked online. I'll tell you the price and I'll give you the review of course. Let's do this. Let's go. Where are you going? Oh, Ostrich farm. We're doing a tour. Play Gosh, wow. they're so big. Yeah, ostrich eggs. Kuna kubwa kule gani? Ini maya yenye wehi. Mona shilia kwenye nguvu. Mama si kama ya kuku.
What do you think? I love this place. Love this place? Yes. Okay. Okay. So we want to what? We want to have an to ride the ostrich. We want to ride the ostrich, guys. <laughs> Gosh. An ostrich ride. <laughs> ostrich dance. Oh, we've been told that whenever mm. they want to do to mate, they do um some oh, sort the of male have to dance. To dance yes. and impress the female. Yes. So that they can <laughs> Wow. So dirty. Yeah. Testing the ostrich eggs. Mm. What do you think? It's good actually. It's good. Mm. I want to try it out. It tastes, it tastes like better version of uh, chicken eggs. That's nice. Hmm. Mm, I love it. So hi guys, welcome to today's vlog and catching up with this vlog. Last time we went to the ostrich farm after getting lost so many times and I didn't give a review of that place. Let me start with the food. 10 out of 10 guys. So we had a platter that had uh, ostrich, then there was some chicken and goat meat and it was so good. Then we went for a tour at the ostrich farm and it was a really nice tour and we tried the ostrich eggs. Uh, for a full cooked ostrich keg. Ostrich keg? Did you hear that, baby? Mm. For a full cooked uh, ostrich egg, it was around 4,500 bob, but it's a very big portion. So we had portions. A portion of the ostrich egg goes for around 500 bob. And if you want to carry an ostrich egg home, it goes for around uh, 3,000 bob. Then they sell the ostrich shells in the holder. The ostrich shell goes for a thousand bob and the holder goes for around 800. So it was a totally worth it drive to the ostrich farm at Kitengela. So today uh, I want to run some errands. Uh, I'm going to Isli with a friend. I want to get a duvet, then some gym clothes and some sports shoes because we're resuming gym on Monday. And guess what, guys? I was supposed to take an Uber because there's no way I'm driving to Isli. One, it's very risky. Two, uh parking there is quite a hassle but mr man there hey mr man, <laughs> mr. man. <laughs> see you're my mr man uh -huh. so mr man there decided nope i am going to drop you because i want you to be safe so thank you welcome so let's go right yes come with us come with us say hi good morning everyone good morning your hair is bad i keep telling you that but he's decided he's getting his dreadlocks back as long as you maintain them okay Umoja, uh, they sell shoes, the fit that walk Africa. I know you are from getting gym shoes. Yes, that's for me. This is yours. Yep. I'm guessing. I think I'm going it's to mine, unbox mine from. I'm going to unbox from home. Yes. Okay. Hold it for me. Nice. Hi guys, welcome to today's vlog and yesterday I went to sleep. I wasn't able to record because of security purposes of course and later on I went to get some gym wear for me and Ian because we'll be resuming gym on Monday. So first things first, from Isli I got this beautiful duvet, nowadays I love white. It comes as a duvet, a bed sheet and two pillowcases. This is a 6x6 six six, and I got it for 1500 Kenya shillings. 
that's very affordable honestly that's very affordable because i know the kind of prices i used to get these things for and i am happy about it i also got a duvet cover for a six by six bed as well this is the duvet cover comes uh, as a duvet cover then we have uh, two pillowcases and of course a bed sheet so the plan is i want to get a lot of duvet covers so that um I can have different looks for my bed for our bed that is so i'm going to get this in different colors or different designs just for a change but i love them this was going for around um 2500 kenya shillings quite value for money because i saw this at some other store which i won't mention around town it was going for 5000 kenya shillings actually my mattress cover I got it for 5,000 Kenya shillings and there I can get it for half the price so if you want to know the specific shops kindly comment down below I'm going to be sharing the details with you on to the next items for my gym wear of course a lot of sports bra for me here they are quality ones I love them uh, I also got some some vests and a t-shirt this is a workout t-shirt for me and I have these amazing vests over here. I got two of them. And I love them because they are really quality. Uh, for Ian, I got him um, some what? Some shorts. Here they are. I got him a ton of shorts here. Around five for a whole week. One, two, three, four, five. And he's wearing one actually and one vest. I also got some biker shorts for me guys take a look if you know me by the way i don't love tights i don't love trousers i just like being in short stuff okay shorts shorts that is biker shorts a short that's my style it's very comfy i got this one i also have this one oh my god and i love them because they are really good quality i also got this other one and of course this one over here for Ian t-shirts and vests, I got him like around for a week that is. This is his vest. There's a t-shirt for him and of course another vest. And guys, guess what? A gym is not complete without gym shoes. Let me show you what we got from Umoja. Umoja is a Kenyan brand and I want to tag them because they really have quality stuff and well-priced stuff. Let me just show you guys. So, for me, let me show you. For me yesterday, I got these workout shoes for myself. Let me show you these ones. How cute are they? Oh my God. And they're really good quality and very well priced. This is the packaging it comes with. Ian got these amazing workout shoes. He said he will get more next week. Guys, take a look at this. This is really quality and it was value for money it was well priced let me say that and guys guys do i need to tell you because this is really good he said he's going to get uh, another pair next week maybe they'll have new stock but this is value for money guys and guess what ian saw this shoe and he was like why did you get this one for yourself he got it for me another pair because he loves this color and i didn't get this color yesterday so it's basically the same shoe but in different colors i think i'm going to get another pair next week also so guys take a look at this this is really good really good quality and value for money as well so that is what i got for yesterday and uh, shout out to to moja it's a kenyan brand and please let's support our, our own because our own is good just take a look very nice very comfy as well for workouts till we meet in the next one i need to cook it's very late i have some errands to run as well so guys i'll see you in the next one